Welcome to the short demo of Amos Project Team 6. Our industry partner Siemens faced a problem. As they source electric components from a huge variety of vendors and producers, adapting to technological change needs to be a part of everyday business. Replacing a single component in an electrical appliance, like a resistor, can be complicated though, as there are hundreds of possible replacements with hundreds of relevant attributes, and contextual engineering knowledge is required to evaluate their fit. In order to simplify this process, we designed and implemented a web app based on a Siemens internal machine learning model, supporting engineers in the decision process by presenting them alternatives to the component at hand with a good predicted fit. The user should be able to first identify a component and then search for similar components. They should then be able to save and export those search results and comment on search results. These comments should then be able to be reviewed by an administrator who can transmit the comments to the database for retraining of the machine learning model. Some non-functional requirements that we had were that we should use Mendix, a low-code platform owned by Siemens, for the implementation of the front end and deploy the back end on Azure. Those two should communicate via a REST API. Our Mendix website communicates with this REST API, which is defined in an open API specification. This REST API then triggers Azure function calls, which offer functionality for retrieving information about the components in the database, adding new components, comparing two components, and submitting feedback. The function calls have access to an SQL database containing the components and an Azure Machine Learning Studio instance hosting the model. You see the main page of our Similarity Detector web app. First, the user can select a component type and enter a search string. They can then select the desired component from the rendered list. Additionally, the user can add some filters to narrow down the search results. After that, the user can start the similarity search. Upon completion of the request, a list of similar components is shown below. The user can then look at all information about the component or request a PDF. Down here, the user can suggest similar components or add a new component. Edit components, all su similar suggestions, will be shown in the Edit Components tab. From here, they can be transferred to the database.